This may be one of the biggest game changers in the AI video world, for now at least. Runway just launched a big time update. It's called Olive. This is where it could perform a wide variety of edits on an input video, such as adding, removing, and transforming objects, generating any angle of a scene, and modifying style and lighting, among many other tasks. So from Runway directly, here are just a few of the very impressive things that you can do. For one, you can instantly generate new camera angles. You can create seamless continuations of your story where Olive can then easily generate the next shot in your sequence by predicting what exactly happens next in a specific scene. You can change the environments, locations, and seasons, and also the time of day. And you can also add things to a scene, seamlessly integrate new elements into existing scenes like adding crowds to empty seats place products on tables or inserting props and where you can add things you can also remove things from a scene look at this example right here removing smoke left hand side is the original now the generated output the smoke is gone removing a person also removing the reflection that's going to be very helpful left hand side you could see the person in the reflection in the new generated output you no longer can you can also change objects in the scene where we have a car, but now it is going to be a horse and buggy, including also changing the material. You can also apply the motion of a video to an image and it just keeps going on and on. You could use a reference image and say something like make the house the color of this image and also describe it like you see in these examples right here. And perhaps one of my favorites and most helpful, you can extract a person or an object and instantly make it a green screen this really does take things up to a whole new higher level so let's go ahead and start this process now i'll also include a link in the description to this helpful guide right here specifically for runway olive and as we scroll down you can see some of these examples we briefly touched on right here but the first one i want to show you that i started with is going to be something similar to where i changed a soccer ball into a completely different object in this case a glowing sphere now if we hit over here into my prompt portal database I'm specifically going to head over into my AI video section as I begin the scroll I'll show you exactly what I did for the very first time I used this now with this screen still of this video right here you could see it's just a soccer match being played and a just a basic soccer ball right here so what I did was basically emulate this task right here where instead of saying a glowing lava rock I went over in the runway and I basically said change the ball to a neon glowing sphere so here is the original video right here you can see the ball is just a basic soccer ball now with that new instruction check this out right here I'll hit the play button and now look at this ball it really is a glowing sphere now one important thing to keep in mind is when you utilize this new update in runway it says that it only takes the first five seconds of the video that you're uploading so if you do want to actually change something in particular make sure it is actually included in the first five seconds of the video that you upload okay so the next thing i want to do is open up this video right here now with this video you can see the still right there let me go ahead and bring in the actual video so in this specific video right here here is the play button pretty impressed with this video what I want to do now is change the weather to where this alien is actually washing his UFO during a thunderstorm now that this new update is activated all you have to do is simply come in here and drop the video that you want to completely edit once it's uploaded and now there it is right there just simply provide your command now one other thing you want to keep in mind is when using this new feature you want to start your command with some sort of a verb change make something that's going to have an action step so in this case specifically that's exactly what i'll do down here in the bottom left hand corner i'm going to go ahead and say change the weather to a severe thunderstorm that's all we're going to do simple 
but yet effective. Now, let's go ahead and generate that. Now, this is taking about usually three to five minutes. As I scroll down, you can see it's already in the process. Now, the fun part is really gonna start because I wanna dive in to some of these more impressive things that it could do. So now, the next thing I wanna do is see how good of a job it can do with actually removing a person and actually giving me that green screen background instead. But then after that, I really wanna take things to a new level by seeing how good of a job it can actually do when I do use a reference image to completely transform the whole entire scene. But before we start this other one, check this out. It looks like my alien guy is done. He's washing his car in a thunderstorm. That is fantastic. I mean, it did it perfectly well. The lightning's in the background, rain, thunderstorm, and it even gives me that darker thunderstorm type environment. Okay, now let's come back over here and do the next thing with getting that green screen. So the next video I'm gonna upload is this one right here. And to ensure I follow the same process that runway recommends let's scroll down on their actual guide and follow the command now you could see it's very simple green screen the person okay so I'll try that same exact thing by just simply saying green screen the person or green screen the object if it's that simple to be honest I'm gonna be incredibly impressed left hand side that's exactly what I just said green screen the person and now hit generate. Let's go ahead and start the process of taking things up a notch. Now we're gonna try this with a reference image to completely transform our environment. So back in my prompts portal, and for this one, let's go specifically into my scenery and architecture tab right here. Now here it is. What I'm gonna actually do is go ahead and download an image like this one. So I'll hit that download button. We're actually going to use this image as a reference guide in order to completely transform a new environment. Okay, so the next thing I'm gonna do is over here on the left-hand side, I went ahead and I added this video, this old school comedy sitcom from like the 90s. Now, down here in the left-hand corner, I said change the environment to this style. Now, this is the style I was talking about earlier. It's gonna have that neon sort of a look. Now, I uploaded that as a reference image in the bottom left-hand corner just by simply dragging it and dropping it right here into this dialog box. It automatically uploads, and now it's already at 26%. We'll see if this comedic scene, this old school 90s scene, can now have its environment transformed into this vibrant neon look. So while that is being generated, now it's time to look at our green screen screen video to see how good of a job it did by completely removing the background and now giving me a complete green screen for that person instead. Let's go to that other tab and right off the bat, look how awesome this is. It did it flawlessly. Left hand side's the original. Now I get a new green screen, allowing me to put this person into any other sort of environment just like that. Okay, so the next thing I did was I took this video right here from this very popular TV series. Now, if you watch the show, you probably know who this is. And now I wanted to try one of these other examples where I could change the character's appearance from, in this example, a young man to an old man. And all you had to say was make him old. I did the same thing over here and look how good of a job it did. I literally said, you could see up here at the top, it just says make her much older. And now look at that. Same exact video, I'll actually bring them up side by side so you could actually see how good of a job it did. And now there it is right there. Look, there is the original top left-hand corner. And in fact, yes, she is much older, but still maintaining the same style, look, and feel. Wow, now that is incredibly impressive how good of a job Runway did. And now it looks like our comedic scene is done, and wow, look at this one. For reference, this is the original right here, and now let's hit the play button on this one. Just by using that reference image, it gave me exactly what I was looking for. Taking out any complex editing, this can do this with just some of the simple prompts that you could possibly use. There are so many different scenarios that you can use this for. So again, I really do think this is a game changer and only the beginning for AI video creations. It's only going to get better from here. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And if you like this video, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. I'll see you next time.